Hey everyone, Ramdi here, and if you want a simple solution to making your videos more creative and engaging, well, I have it, and it's called Stock Media. Only thing is, finding free stock media to use that's actually good quality and worth using is pretty much impossible. So what you're gonna have to do is spend a ton of money on subscription services to source that stock media. What's that? Descript already has millions of video and audio assets that don't suck? And they're free to use? Well, let's get into how to use them then, shall we? All right, so as you can see, I'm in my project here, and I already have my video nice and transcribed. Now to add my stock needs. And there's a couple ways that I can do this. Firstly, I can use Descript's media library. And this is where you store all your imported media, as well as access to Descript's stock media library. I have access to millions of videos, GIFs, images, or I can use AI to generate a new image. And we've also got audio like music and sound effects. So in this section here where I talk about basketball, I wanna add some basketball B-roll. So first I'll add my scene boundaries, then I'll hop back into my media library, which I can also pin to the side if I wanna keep it open. I'll go into the video tab and I'll type in basketball. Now I can hover over the videos to see which one I like, and let's go with this one. So I can either just click or drag it onto the canvas or script, and that's it. And if I have my own stock media that I wanna use, I can simply import it through the media library or through the add layer button in my script. Speaking of the add layer button, that's the second way I can add stock media into my video. I can either set my scene boundaries and then click on the add layer button to look for stock media, or I can simply highlight the portion of my script I want my media to be on, then again, click on the add layer button and look for stock media through there. And when I select my media, scene boundaries will automatically be applied to my script. Cool, so now that I have my media, I can select the layer in the canvas and change the position and size of it. And by right clicking, I can also change the layer ordering if for example, I wanna use it as a background for a green screened clip. And over here in the properties panel, I can control where my clip starts so I make sure it's showing exactly what I want. And I can also set it to play once or to loop. And that's pretty much it. As you can see with the script's millions of free assets readily available to you, it makes spicing up your project so much easier and so much cheaper. So now I can creep you out without having to pay any extra money to license this song. But that's it for me. If you have any questions on using stock media in Descript, make sure to leave a comment down below or you can check out our help center, which is also linked in the description below. And now I'm going to use the image tab to AI generate a picture of two lines playing chess to decide once and for all who's the real king of the jungle. Oh look, nice. All right, see you guys in the next one. Bye.